Well, I feel like we're rounding third base. It's, uh, I believe it's December 21st or maybe the 22nd. I lost track of time. And I need to leave on January 16th or the 15th. Uh, I'm doing a project with some high school kids down in Virginia and they're unveiling the project on the 17th and they want me to be there. They've uh, converted a tractor from gasoline to electric. And uh, if you've been on my website, you know I'm all about that. But anyways, the back of the uh, trailer, or the camper, done. Backup lights, stop and turn signals. A uh, new lock installed, had to make a plate to fill up the hole because the guy that installed it the first time really messed it all up. All works now. Made this uh, diamond plate threshold. Uh, there's a very thin piece of aluminum right here that stops the rain from coming in under the door. And uh, I was constantly stepping on it and crushing it, bending it. It was a mess when I got it. I had to straighten it all out. But anyways, this will give you a pretty good idea of where we stand. Uh, we'll start at the back here and move forward. This is the bathroom area. And I just finished this up today. And this has a flip-up lid. The interior of this is going to get covered with uh, what's called poly wall. It's a very thin plastic laminate. So here on the left side, we've got our kitchen countertop. It came out pretty good. It's actually laminate, fl laminate flooring that I'm using. Uh, we put some uh, subway tile, peel and stick. I love this stuff. It cleans up real easy, looks great. Uh, new blinds, which by the way, when you take a 72 inch long blind and you need to cut it down to 18 inches, it takes forever. Yeah, we got a TV, a brand new insignia with um, Roku so we can watch things. I put new lights and these lights are really nice. They uh, can be three different light intensities. I don't know if you can see this on the uh, on the camera and they're also dimmable which is really pretty cool. I love this daylight. They say this is the same light as January, I'm sorry, as July 15th, middle of the summer. Fire extinguisher, trash barrel, over here, those wires are from the solar panels on the roof. That is where that contraption that I built for the solar system will go. On that wall right there. The cooler is now on a slide out. I kind of have to lift it up a little bit. So I mounted a handle on it. And now it, uh, it's pretty nice. It just slides right out. Just pulls right out. Easy to get into. And then it just slides right back in. If you remember, I had built a little cabinet over here that had these little plastic bins that were acting as shelves. It was kind of neat, but it, it just didn't work with the sink and everything. It just, it wasn't right. So I built this little cabinet. And uh, I'll be putting some shelves in there or something. The water tank is under this area here, and I can lift this up, and I can see the level of the water, how much water is in the tank, which was pretty important to see that, because I'm not putting any type of system in there. Yeah, we got a clock. The bed folds out. Bought some bins over at the... Uh, container store I think it's called. Then I mounted a bungee cord with some stainless steel marine cleats I had hanging around. Not sure what this hole was that was here from the original owner but a medicine cabinet that I'm making is gonna go here with a mirror. 
I blocked off some of the windows between the truck cap with foam. Uh, they'll get covered with that poly wall when I do that project. And everything else is being insulated with foam. Over here we have where the uh, propane is going to be stored. That's about it. Oh, put this uh, pool noodle up here. And I was constantly clobbering my head once again, just like I did on my motorcycle trailer. Now, every time I hit it, I just bounce off it. So, it's small, but it's homey. Today, a couple of accoutrements made these little shelves, a place to put your wallet and your keys and your wristwatch. Another one down here in the kitchen area for spices or whatnot. Uh, the new faucet will be here within a couple hours. I'll get that installed. Then I got to do the plumbing. Plumbing and wiring is next. Everything else is basically done. But by the way, this little heater. Uh, which runs, right now I got the door open so it's running quite a bit. It's amazing how warm it gets in here. Uh, today it's uh, in the mid-30s, but this morning when I started to work it was 20 degrees. I turned this heater on and I'm telling you within 10 minutes I had to take uh, one of my jackets off. It was really too warm. Well that's it. That's what we got. Thanks for watching.